Guys, um, enjoy video games for the story and not just the graphics, man, because I remember a time where graphics weren't so advanced, so we pondered into different titles and we had open minds when getting new games from GameStop or your local game store, whatever the case may be. But as time went on and technology increased, we started to care less about independent titles and we only cared about main franchise titles. And it's not even just simply that we only cared about main franchise titles. You didn't hear about the, the other ones because their competition took them out of the market. But what I will tell you guys is a lot of you guys are missing out on good games because you're paying attention to the name brand instead of enjoying the story. You see, a new franchise, if you give it the chance, could become the best game that you've ever played. You see, there's a lot of people, man, that'll sit there and say, oh, I'm not going to play it because a lot of people don't play it, bro. So, oh, man, I'm not going to be positive because a lot of people are negative. How does that sound? Think about what I'm saying. When you say you're not going to do something because a lot of people don't do it, dude, that should be even more of a reason for you to do it. Don't have a sheep mentality. Try things. Like I told you in the last episode earlier, you will not know what you think about it until you give it a chance. Don't be so caught up in the graphics that you miss out in the story of the game. Um, with Naruto, man, the anime that you see me, the shirt that I'm wearing right now, I used to never want to watch the anime because I the first anime that I ever saw was Dragon Ball Z. I was watching Samurai Jack, the original Pokemon, etc. So I never cared about Naruto because I looked at the characters and I didn't get into the story. So once I got into the story of it, I was like, bro, I've never related to an anime more. I've never related to an anime character more. Naruto being the popular, the popular, ex, the popular introvert that everyone knew but no one wanted to be around dude i was always the most popular person but at the same time i was an independent thinker so it scared people away from me and naruto he scared people away from him because he had the nine tails of cherokee in him but what i say all that to say this is that don't knock something until you give it to give it a chance because you might enjoy it you might relate to it there might be so many different sensations that you have that correlate with the story but don't be caught up with the messenger pay attention to the message you see i can make this message universal because a lot of people they sit there and they worry about the cover of the book but not the contents to any believers out there when you look at the cover of the bible does that look alluring no but it's about the contents that are in there some of the greatest books that i've read the cover wasn't all that. It was the contents of the story that was able to alert me. So a lot of you guys aren't giving things chances because of common perception or because you have preconceived notions. So give things chances. Focus on the story. Don't predicate your attention upon the graphics. Because graphics don't define everything. Some of the best RPG games... Terrible graphics, amazing stories. So yeah, everybody likes things that appeal to the eye, appeal to the senses, but what is it doing for you? You see, a lot of games are good graphics now. You play them and you get off because there's nothing alluring about it. You know, COD, they did what they were supposed to. They brought back the campaign. That was amazing. It made it feel a whole lot more like a Call of Duty game. But for the longest time, it was like, okay, we're just playing this game. There's no basis to it. There's no story to it. And when there's no story to something, it's like you. It's like you trying to get on here and talk. If you're not an example of the messages that you're giving, if people can't sense your pain through the words you're saying, you don't have a story. You're just graphics. If I get on here and I just look good like this and I'm just looking at the camera, I got good graphics, but I don't got a story. So people ain't going to hear what I have to say. They might say they want to, but do they really? Are they really getting anything? Is it edifying their soul? No. So with that being said, pay attention to the story and not solely the graphics. So with that being said, man, I'm going to read all these comments. Make sure you guys tap the follow on the bell button. If you would like to extend this episode past this normal duration or talk about anything you want to talk about, I need to see 100 diamonds. Tap the follow on the bell button now. I'm going to read all these comment sections. The most basic outside of something can have the best insides. It's like the COD Black, Abu, Black Ops was the best. Was the best. Favorite thing to eat right now? That don't have nothing to do with what I'm talking about, so I ain't even going to respond to that. Got to keep that open mind in all aspects. 100% facts. The main characters are family to me. Facts. The campaign and ghosts in WW2, it hits hard, goes so deep that it makes me feel like facts. Hey, bro, reminds me of Juice World. I don't look nothing like Juice World. Shout out to Juice World, though. Shout out to I Like Milk for the follow. Video games, no matter what it is, will always be the best 
your friends around no matter the story. Just the campaign alone. I enjoyed COD Ghosts and COD World War II. Yeah. How many more episodes? Okay. Man's got some intellect to share. Yeah, man. Um, I be using things as analogies and I correlate it all together. It starts off looking like an empty puzzle, but when you put all those little pieces together, the picture is quite astonishing. Good stories and all, but not always the best graphics facts. But with that being said, I don't see any more diamonds. So I'm going to conclude this and get on to episode number nine. So make sure you guys tap the follow on the bell button so you can catch the next one. I hope you live as long as you want and never want as long as you live. Peace.